Hello everybody, this is Aiden from Select Inc, and today we're playing some more Dishonored. Uh... Hey, what was that? Oh, hey, dude. No, I heard something. No, you heard what nothing. You heard nothing. <laughs> Shut up. Yeah, we're playing some Dishonored. Last time we just got all this cool loot from our mysterious friends who keep leaving, uh, leaving us notes all over the place. Uh, I'm gonna... Ooh, I beheaded someone. That's awesome. Hey, dude, I'm not here. Take what? I'm totally not here. Oh, they're giving rats. Hey, dude. I know you're here. No, you don't. Ha! You little bastard! Oh! You killed a rat. Not cool, dude. Oh wait, no, there's a rat plague. No, it's totally cool. Don't worry about it. Call out to each other spotted. Oops. Probably wasn't the best idea to shoot that guy in the back of the head. Corpse. There seems to be loads of corpses in the sewers. People just flew, flee to the sewers once they're like, Oh, look, a plague. Better get to the... A rat plague. Better get to the place where there's the most rats. Even in games, people aren't smart. Oh, wow, he's following me. Wait, does he know I'm here? Oh, Jesus Christ, that scared me. Oh, my God. Oh, a trash bin. has temporarily escaped state custody. Several brave officers of the state are dead by his hand. He is to be captured or killed at any cost. Did I make it? What is this? Bravo. Oh. Over here. Quickly, I'm a friend. Hey, dude. I'm Samuel. Oh, Samuel. And I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. Uh huh. Well, they said you'd come out here. I can still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. All right then. All right, let's go. Old man, I'm rude. I'm extremely rude in this game. Mission status. Right. Uh huh. <laughs> what does it mean, ghost never detected? What the hell does that mean? Uh, okay, continue. The Hound Pit Pub. I'm going to a pub. I'm gonna get pissed. Hidden alleys. Hidden in an old bar on the river, your new allies have plans to share with you. Meet with the loyalists in a circle to learn what they've got in their mind. In in mind. Ugh, I keep reading things wrong. Nice boat, dude. This is the Hound Pits pub. Closed for business. Half the district marked off is dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Everyone has weird noses in this game. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. I'll take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the Lordists. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, oh, he's drifting. Name, he can. Oh, are we gonna crash? Please say we crash. Ah, oh, we crashed a little bit, dude. You should have like done some awesome crash while we crash and burn. That would have been so cool. All right, where are we going? Okay. Mission clues. Samuel, the boatman, has smuggled you across the river from Cold Ridge Prison. He works for an underground movement opposed to, to the illegal re regime of the Lord Regent, and has brought you to meet the numbers, meet the members of his organization. Okay, I guess I can just walk past you, right, Samuel? Cheers for the lift, by the way. Nice one. All right, that doesn't. There's people in there. That's a metal door. We can guys. continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvall, oh, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, yeah, like so you. so ugly. And 
until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with you. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered, but before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times. But his industrious mind buys him that right. All right. Yes. Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. Dude, you totally just blew smoke into my face. That's not cool. So, Piero. He's a posh prick, isn't he? Piero. Oh, the door's open. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work for you. I will create the tools of a master assassin. Okay. No, this cannot happen now. The tank of whale oil is running. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. The oil is unstable. When it explodes, there is a terrible mess. You're a lazy asshole. you know that, right? You can't walk up st- Oh, look- <gasps> Dude! We're playing Portal! Okay, okay. <sighs> uh. Yep, that didn't work. Okay, then. Whale- the Excerpt- Excerpt from the notes of a national fasolof- Philosopher aboard a whaling ship. Remarkably, each specimen I've had the pleasure of studying during the voyage possessed some minor variants in psych sociology. I think that's sociology. On the second leg of the trip, east of Tyvia, the crew hauled aboard a female, some forty-two inches. Or is that feet? No, I think that's inches. I'm not entirely sure. In length, I estimated she weighed thirty-three. 35 tons, Jesus. And the ship sat low, rocking side to side through the night and with her thrashing. By candlelight, I took her part, stretching the way, sketching and taking notes against her bellowing. I cut into the massive test tentacles around her mouth. Within, I found row upon row of teeth and a baleen running along the upper jaw. Though, through this broom-like structure, I assumed she filtered food from the water that was too small to be shooed. Okay then. Whale oil, probably I cannot be asked to read all this. Let's just talk about whale oil. The Academy teaches that absurd idea that the energy in whale oil arises from the need to maintain life functions at extreme pressure in the cold are too much to endure without it. I speculate that a human being might, by a process of adaptation, produce high energy humors in the body. I could build a tank that would slowly increase pressure on a subject over a long period of time and then observe them for years if need be to see if the formulation of energetic substances developed. Surely the Empress would be able to furnish me with facilities subject to the necessary legal amnesty. Alright, well that made absolutely no sense to me. Okay then. Damn it, I really thought that would be a portal. <laughs> Perfect. Really I'll annoying. plug it in. How do I plug it in? Okay then, that was easy. Just perfect. Thank you, Cole. No problem, dude. Here, see? The assassin's mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will mean terror to them. He Just made me a mask. Hold still. Fit must be precise. There. Oh, this looks good. Can weird. you see normally? Send the lens out of the line. 
There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for Much valuables, better. and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Okay. Tell me what I can make for you. Oh. Yeah, let's let's have a look what he's got. Crossbow bolt, sleeping bolt, bullet, spring razor, repair tool, rewire tool, and a grenade. Upgrades. Crossbow accuracy. I guess he wants me to buy this, right? Or this. Does everything cost 300 pounds? Or coins? Bulk capacity, bullet capacity, mask optics. I don't know what that means. Bone charm capacity. Don't know what that means either. Uh, so I guess I'm just gonna go with crossbow accuracy. Stabilizes bullet aim. Okay, screw it. I'll buy that. Right, cool. You must be exhausted. I advise that you get some sleep. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. He talks really slowly. Sleep well. Thanks, dude. <laughs> He's pretty creepy, actually. Somewhere else. Right? No description. Awesome. Wait, did I sleep? Fair enough. Okay. Yeah, can I go this way? What the hell happened to this place? Um, I'm gonna stop it here. Thanks for watching. This has been Aiden. Goodbye.